come back. Cause now, so now we're gonna head to Abatos. We're gonna head to Abatos because we need to find we need to find someone who's good, who is an ice who uh what he thought. We need to find someone who's good at making ice cream. And we know who's who does there. So he doesn't even know. So, and as you can't find his you can't find his son any you can't find that guy's son anywhere who's the one of the people singing yada yada yada. He's just busy, I guess. Whatever. That's fine. Let's go to this guy. The whole world. Then why don't you why don't you give me any ice cream? Take that! Damn it! Damn it, Stan! All right, take this! What? No! Damn! Damn it! Shut up! And now, I don't. And yeah, let's see. And now we're gonna go to Spagonia. It's a, it's an it's an unexpected stop because just because I know Sandra's there, and I'm. And I thought that if I did Spagonia here, she'd go right to Shamar, but it appears she wouldn't go right to Shamar. However, either way, either way, I actually do wind wind up in the footage I recorded getting her to, getting her over to Shamar by luck. And then do, and then doing that question and doing the last all all the questions because I know it ends off in I know it ends off in Shamar. Who can forget his name? Who can forget, who can forget him? I mean, he starts off by yelling hello in your face. Alright. Fake Bush! No, we'll wait longer. Oh, wait, where's where's the sister at? Where's her older sister at? Don't tell me. Oh, um. Oh, oh, thank God, it's not what I thought it was. Jesus, that that little sister has to put up with a lot of shit. You don't, you didn't think anyone would find you here? You didn't think anyone would find you here? This room is lit up, and it's right next to the laboratory of a professor. How could you... It has no door. It has no door to close, either. So how do you think no one's gonna find you in here? That's why there's even a metal in that room. So, seriously. Ah, uh, shit. I was supposed to think of a joke for that. I was supposed to think of a joke for that. Never mind. <laughs> Pathetic. This is not a hideout. But why? Uh, what now? Why am I taking so long to answer that? This is someone else. Wait, this is someone else's house? Then why doesn't it have a door? Who would not put a door in their house? That is the stupidest thing I've ever heard in my life. In the house with one room? Wow! <laughs> wow, who bought that? Who's stupid enough to buy a house like that? Now for you. There's the guy in Apertos. <sighs> Alright. Well, there's so here's something to do here right now, so... We'll go to Apertos, I guess. I thought I got my fortune tell here, but I guess I didn't. No shit, I didn't. It's too early. Yeah. Yeah. 
That's pretty much it. I mean, they will, like, do stuff. He'll, he will ask you how to make ice cream. He will, you can, there's actually three answers. He'll make three answers, and none of them seem like actual how to make ice cream lessons. They just seem like, like, you know, lessons like putting love into your, love and care into things, stuff like that. It's kind of like, um, kind of stupid. You know, those, those are, those are tips for people. Those are, those are tips about how putting love into something makes it makes it better. Oh wait, wait, sister's gone. Oh shit, she looks in. Look, that doesn't look good. Oh no, not this mission. Yeah, you thought that you thought that older sister was a bitch before. This is now she's really gonna piss you off. This is this is one of the most annoying missions in the entire game. Ow! What the hell? Are you supposed to be. It's supposed to send you flying high enough so you can get that 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 cliff is supposed to send you flying high enough to go off. Bullshit. Apparently, when you're too close, it doesn't work. So let's try to so, see now it works. Get it? That's gonna that was gonna stupid. Anyway, so let's see. Take note: the following shortcut on the loop. You have to take this to win. You must take that shortcut. There is no way to win without it because of how, because of the below flat. Because it will take too long. You'll never make it in time if you don't take this shortcut. Boosh! All right, let's see. This is literally one of the most annoying missions ever. Anyway, here we go. Basically, you meet. It basically expects you to meet to go to the second half of the level in about. That I. About I'm guessing. I'm guessing like uh. Minute thirty seconds. I can't. I can't remember how much time this mission had on it when it began. Though. Anyway, uh, still mission. This mission still. That's, this is pretty ballsy. It's pretty ballsy. Although it is possible to do that. At first, it seemed ridiculous to me because of that. I didn't know about that shortcut on the loop. Anyway, boosh. Is it me or do the- so the pillars conveniently manage to collapse when Sonic will die? What are the pill- what, do the pillars hate blue or something? It's like, do they get seizures when they, when they see the color blue or something? Uh, I'm not gonna comment, I was about to make a bad joke, a really bad joke that I shouldn't have made, and I don't- and I don't even like- and I think it's- I don't even think it's funny, so never mind. Alright. Wait, did I just go through her? HOLY SHIT SHE'S A GHOST! I'M TOO LATE! Yes. Oh wait! I'm not. The mission I succeeded. I think she No shit. So you think you're yeah, no shit, she was worried about you. What do you think? She's gonna she's gonna what do you think she's gonna be rooting for you to die or something? Okay, and... She better have. But moving along. Now for, now for what I hate the most, the fortune telling in this. This is, this is major suck ass. Is it literally... I, try, I always try to get, make it Sonic's personality, but apparently it's designed for the players. But it's still, it's stupid. Why? Half these questions aren't even questions Sonic can answer. It should have been more for so it should have been made for Sonic, I think. And see how close you can get it to Sonic's personality for fans. See how close fans can get it to Sonic's personality. Or at least they should have included a personality that describes Sonic really well. However, it's literally every personality you look at has a she always manages to just say she always manages to point out a big flaw. She gives small little nice compliments, and then she points out a, a gigantic flaw, and then gives you some lesson on it. It's really annoying, and it's like this. It just it just pisses you off. It just it just pisses me off. 